It's time for YouTube's top five I'm sure types of content. What's in the box? All right. Again today, for my boy Steven, always holding it down. Much love to you. Let's see what we got in here. To for your games. Tone, I know you're getting all that free teaching stuff. Send me some. But all right, we got. Let's let it be a mystery to you and me. Okay. And some brown paper bag. The Vanna White girls. The Drew Carey girls. Well, nowadays, it's the Drew Carey men. It's all good. And Dragon Ball Super Heroes. Oh, with sleeves, too. Is that the Guyver sleeves? I don't know. All right, let's check out these Dragon Ball superheroes. Yeah, my boy Steven, he was telling me about this recently. I think he said the ones with the P on it, those are promos, which are not kind of the official tissue cards. The ones that come out of the machine. So this is like a, um arcade machine in Japan where you do all kind of crazy crazy movements with the cards and then like you know it's kind of like mario party mini games and then you move the cards all around kind of like this so like you might move it in a semicircle or just move it real fast it looks like a semicircle then if you do it in the proper way then the character will respond correctly um like on the screen and then defeat the opponents so like from what i saw it's like you'll get like five versus five teams or something then it's kind of like Gwent where you like push the cards up and you push them on a row and then you take them back and kind of throw it. All right. Uh, anyway, this guy, don't even know what this guy's name is, Janimba or something. I don't even know. I haven't kept up with Dragon Ball Super at all. But uh, Capsule Corp. Got, okay, HP stat. I'm sure that's an attack stat in that red. And then the yellow, I don't know. Funny how they got HP in English than uh, the other, the last two in Japanese. All right. Is that still a Giver back? Nope, a whole different back. Yu-Gi-Oh back. GX, because they on their bike, I think. Okay. Uh, this guy, 3,200, 5,900, 1,500, seven drop perhaps. Cool. Then we got a uh, Bart Bardock or Raditz. Raditz. Yeah, it gotta be Raditz, right? Alright, uh 2500, 5100, 1500, 7 drop. And then the movement for that one is maybe shaking it back and forth. I don't know. No, shaking it in a V. Wow. Okay, then we got a gold freezer. What kind of bet we got on that? The Giver thing again. Okay, Gold Freezer looks like a 7-drop, 3,500, 5,200. So he has a big attack. No, actually not even that big of a attack. All right. Then we got this guy. He's going to be in the new movie that's coming out real soon. Notice that from the trailer. All right, 4-drop. Got her back. And you move this guy in a whole circle, it looks like. Move it in a circle real fast or at a certain speed. Tempo. Okay, and then this dude. This is one of the first Saiyans that came to Earth, right? Or somebody else. The first Saiyans that came on DBZ, rather. All right, five drop. 26, 25, 20. And then I think you move that one back and forth. 
Okay, then we got this dude who I see all the time, who I should know the name of, but Majin something. 32, 40, 20, 8 drop. Stats are kind of low for an 8 drop. And then you move that one, kind of like a grandfather clock ticking motion. Black one is the Yu Gi Oh! White one is the Giver. Piccolo, 4 drop, 36, 30, 10. You move Piccolo, you might not even have to move Piccolo, looks like it. Okay, then this guy Janemba, I don't even know, but this guy's a popular character. Back and forth, 7 drop, 30, 50, 10. Low stats again, it seems. Uh, this dude, 7 drop, 28, 38, 20. This guy, 30, 55, 10. Um, man, who the hell is this guy? Yamcha. Yeah, uh, 14, 12, 20. Five drop. Uh, some kind of Android looks like. 38, 62. Got a big red stat right there. A big attack stat for a four drop, it looks like. 20. And then you move that one in a figure eight. Uh, Goku Black, Super Saiyan 1. And uh, that that one chick back there, uh, tw twenty nine, forty seven, ten, six drop. Then we got this dude, uh, go ten. Yeah, I'm gonna just guess go ten. Uh, thirty three, forty two, twenty, six drop. You move that one. How do you move this one? You move this one up and down with the capsule. All right, and then we got a Super Saiyan 3, somebody, I don't know, 26, 40, 15 with the Saiyan armor, and you move it in a diagonal pattern. Then we have this hooded guy who was this mystery hooded guy, 6 drop, 30, 35, 15, you move it up and down, and then there's some fireworks going off. And Goku Black, right? Yeah, Goku Black. You move this one all types of ways. 33, 36, 15, 5 drop. All right, a nice Dragon Ball Super Heroes cards. Would love to play that on the arcade one day. Maybe if I ever take a trip to Japan. Maybe it's here in the U.S. I'm sure it is somewhere. Find that one day, play that. All right, what else we got in here? Cyberpunk. Yeah, I got a, um, I have a box, no? Yeah, I have a box of this, the starters. I had a good opportunity to get, um, like a way good deal on it, but I snoozed and lost on it. Cyberpunk. Two cyberpunks, okay. The creator of Cyberpunk, the franchise, the IP, is actually a black dude, so that's something different. I'm all about that. And what's for the last thing? Zombie Invasion. Came from Half Price Books. You can always find some great deals at Half Price Books. Remnants of World's Past. Crusaders of Lornia. It's a Bandai. It looks like a Bandai. Alright, um... Yeah, so for today... We will... Yeah, we'll call it at these Dragon Ball Superhero cards. Save the rest of these for another day. Alright. Foyo Games, and I'm out.